Yo, what is up guys, is that Oreo? So some of you noticed that I changed my controls on Shinobi Strikers and was wondering why. Basically because I play the other Storm franchises like Storm 1 through 4, uh, Generations, and Naruto Storm Revolution. Um, and I got really used to the control schematics that they had for those games and I have muscle memory and I didn't feel like breaking my muscle memory just to play Shinobi Strikers and I really didn't feel like learning um, or kind of getting muscle memory for this game. Uh, so basically, if you're like me, then these controls might help you out, um, but I do have a universal tip, and that would be like the lock-on and the ultimate jutsu, or the whatever they call it in this game. Uh, so I feel like the lock-on should be L3, and I feel like the secret technique should be R3. Uh, basically, the secret technique should be R3 because all your attacking moves are on the right side of the controller, and I just feel like it's very universal. Um, it's weird to click L3 to, you know, do your jutsu to me, your ultimate jutsu. I just feel like it's super weird. Um, as far as lock on, I feel like you should be able to move around and look around and stuff, and then not have to, you know, take your thumb off your analog stick to lock on. You know, I don't think you should be able. To, I don't think you should have to do that. I feel like it's just a very, you know, comfortable and universal thing, um, and that that might, you know. A lot of people might like that one. Uh, I guess if you were a Storm player or a Generations or Revolution, whichever game you're coming from, um, these controls are best at you. So you change your uh, close range attacks to circle. You keep your ninja tools square, jump, and then you'll change your guard to R2. Um, and this is basically because a lot of us have muscle memory from like doing combos and then canceling. Uh, well, jump canceling, jump block canceling, however you want to say it, with R2 and stuff. And I feel like that's just very, <clears throat> kind of like, I think that's where the most of the muscle memory comes from, uh, from the Storm games, is like, you know, hitting circle to attack, you know, uh, hitting square to throw kunai. And I didn't, you know, I'm just super used to that. When I kept, I kept coming into the beta, trying to do, trying to play this like I was playing Storm 4. Um, and so I was, I was having a really tough time in the beta until I switched over my controls. Um, and then lastly, this is, you know, just for me, personally, I changed all of that. Um, I went even further because I don't like holding R2 to uh, block. So I changed my uh, guard to R1. I changed my tracker jump to uh, L1. And I changed my ninja to 1 L2 and ninja to 2 to R2. Um, and I just feel like it's really comfortable for me. I guess it, it all depends on like your hand size or whatever, but it's really comfortable for me to just hold R1 and hit uh, circle. I just feel like my cancel, it just it just feels really good to me. Um, and all of this is opinionated. These aren't like the absolute best, you know, controls. Everybody's gonna be different. Everybody's hands are different. Um, and people's muscle memory is different. So, you know, if some of these tips help you, then great. Um, if some of these didn't work for you, that's also fine. I'm not telling you to change your controls or anything like that. Uh, I'm just letting you know what works for me and kind of how I went about doing it. <laughs> 